Greetings, Sani Bonani. This is a series of uh, presentation focusing on you at UKZN, which is presented by Student Support Services. And my name is Master Mzamo Zodi. Uh, today we are focusing on online learning experience. Siana Mogalage Mashobo, Namshanje, Si Buganje Benganyana, the Kuluma, and Guti. When Zuma Ganjan and Joba says of Funda, Ungeko Utisha, Pambi, we too. This is what you can expect quickly from this presentation. We'll be looking at some common challenges faced by first year students. Is Kinagi Abafundi, Abesnabo, Kala, the figure of Sita Bavano, Ukerana Nazo, Sizobuga, the transition from high school to the university environment and its possible um, and possible challenges and gains from that. <laughs> uh, we'll also share some few tips on how to help you to get started very well in this new normal that we are all uh, operating under. Right, we'll look at the very important aspect uh, of the university environment, the independent learning. Goba manje, usuzo funda ka kurugaz, usuzo mele, unga seko mzadi, unga seko tisha, ozole, ingu kupa ngimumba, eti spanbani, wenzi le ngimu sabenzi. Sizo buka kekuti, tina njenga student support services, what is our focus in this year of 2021? Then, we'll focus now, we'll zoom in directly on the potential challenges faced uh, by most students when it comes to online learning. We'll be using our, our experiences of what happened last year in 2020 when our students uh, were using online learning. So, because of online uh, one of the problems faced by students in the university environment is the issue of identity because they are finding themselves students as a high school university environment and there are many new things that they will be facing and they will tend to struggle with issue of identity uh, as some students that will be coming outside uh, KZ10 will also struggle because some, even the issue of language can be an issue for them because mostly when they're speaking in Sizulu, in uh, English. Uh, so now they have to adapt to this new environment. Um, some students, especially those who will be coming from afar, they will miss home. Abanyege, they face this problem of freedom overload. Ngoba, all your life you've been having your parents near you, telling you what to do and what not to do. This time around, you're in a varsity environment, and there is no one actually telling you what to do and what not to do. So this freedom can be too much for others. Nempulego eningangaga, yabadaga abanyege. Uh, for most of you, this time we'll be, have, we'll be receiving wellness funds, we'll have to manage Maliako, and this can be a problem for somebody who has not been managing any money, and all of a sudden, we saw Tola 1.5 uh, for wellness funds, the allowance for Mekai and Jalun Jalu, Abani Matuna Sabenza is in Abibanga Zin Zimoba, Bani Mali, Enin Asabenayo Manji. Then in What do you want to do actually? Um, what career, what degree are you choosing? Abanyabasa gutinje. Um, problems that are common. Um, Nalenda manje muningi. If a, a high school book booty, so is a meaning, but this time there will be a lot of work 
um, that will be required to do and you really need to put in more time all right um yeah this is a common one poor judgment because maybe some of you in high school you were getting a's and all of that so you come thinking you will continue on that mode yes some of you will be able to continue but what we are trying to say is um be careful of being too overconfident uh, work hard continue working hard and even if you can work twice as hard don't just say in high school i was a star i'll continue being a star no it doesn't work like that right as you can see these pictures uh, in varsity maybe this year there, there will be a little of this the parties um, freshers bashes and all of that this freedom um, now this form of uh, studying you know the lecture halls are in this way and um, it's quite different so the environment will be different um, so it's really not the same like fun day um, so these are some of the reasons why it will be different this time around you have to do things for yourself you are treated as an adult as an independent adult so you have to learn to work alone like this guy is doing at the, at the library and the teaching style is very different and on top of that you will be meeting lecturers from um, different parts of the world and their accent might not be what you are familiar with you will be meeting some lecturers from Nigeria from overseas from everywhere and the accent might be different and this is very important um, yes you will need to manage your time very well because you might feel like you have a lot of time because you are not doing chores that you used to do at home uh, or maybe you feel like there's so much work and there's no little time this issue of culture shock uh, on the top right is a perfect example of that there's this freedom you can go to bashes you can go to yeah to different places so it becomes very very important to be able to balance your personal life your social life with your academic life we are not saying don't have fun we are saying please balance it out Outside in this cut is so good. Begin in the leisure course school. Put a social good. Challenge. Who begin in the not pen. Unga visa puma. Usha umor. Same could be like about the language. Um, but in this part, we are saying each module will have its own specific language. Please be careful of that and take note of that. There will be um form of there will be some form of extra supports. Uh, you will hear about things like essays, you'll hear about things like amateurs. Please make use of all those uh, extra available support. So we mama to Um so we uguzege was fumele and Ube uwe loya ngeli wilang. Uso graduate, uso ba uto hotela so and so. Right. So let us look at some of the tips that we think can help you. Number one, attend all the orientation events like what we are doing now watching this video. Do watch other videos as well. Um, please do ask for help. You kele usizo. You have... Um, uh, lecturers from your school, you have uh, ADOs, you have um, support staff, you have peers, you have mentors, you have friends. Make use of all those uh, possible avenues. So start consistently, not only when you have a test coming up. We'll say more about that in part four. Uh, manage your time wisely. You have weekly planners, have monthly planners, plan your work accordingly. It will be tough. Uh, that's where 
we urge you to stay positive. Uh, don't let things that are coming along the way to derail you. Stay positive and focus on your journey. Please stay true to yourself. You know where you come from. You know Right. On independent learning, yes, um, the, the COVID has forced us to uh, to work online, meaning they will, you will do a lot of work on your own. Um, but uh, take note of these things. Number one, each module will have a course outline uh, telling you certain sections will be covered on, from this time to this time. They, it will tell you about the lecturers responsible for specific sections of that module. It will tell you about due dates. Uh, it will tell you about the prescribed books for that module. Please take note of that. Uh, and this will help you to plan because in these uh, outlines, you'll know when the test is, when the assignments are due. So please use it to plan and keep track. Um, and then please make use of consultation times. They will also be there on the outlines. Please make use of them. Consult your lecturers. Don't feel like we have a shoop. Ah, Bakona, good valley, and batik, and basebenzis. And then please do source to season all corner from lecturers, tutors, peers, abanda sebenga pambil wenu. Similar modules are seven Zs. If ever they would, hey, Nachi Gusenzima, Satonza Ganzima, we are still struggling. Please do seek counseling. We are here to support. Um, right. It is very important to support, to, 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 to focus. So we, Tina, this year at Student Support, um, we, we usually focus on a specific theme. In each year, in the past, we have focused on things like drug abuse, pregnancy, and other issues. But this time around, we are focusing on enhancing your online learning experience because it is what we are facing because of COVID. And it seems to be the future going forward. Uh, even if the COVID is no more, but it's highly likely that we will completely stop using online learning. There is, like Ama talks about, using hybrid learning. Right. Um, quickly, some potential challenges uh, that were faced by students, especially last year, with online learning or remote learning. Some have struggled with infrastructure where they had poor connectivity depending on where your home is. And for some students, there were issues of load shedding and they had tests and all of that. So we urge you to make a plan ahead. If you can move to somebody or to a family member who lives in a place where there's better connectivity, please do that uh, during the times where you won't be at varsity. And uh, again, with issues of load shedding, try and learn in advance and plan appropriately. Um, some students may feel like there is lack of social support because they are not having friends around, their classmates and staff members. Uh, don't let that hinder you. Um, but it has been cited as a potential problem. Right, and for most uh, of our students that are coming from um, a previously disadvantaged environment, environments, um, they reported um, these, these problems where at home, banning uh, gets crowded and the space is so good, uh, even the resources, the space is a desk, the These are some of the challenges. Right now, let us look at how to try and uh, plan against those challenges. So, we encourage you guys to plan um, very well. Uh, have very good uh, time management students as this becomes very, very critical. Uh, so have a clear, a clear plan of how you manage your studies on day-to-day -day basis. 
ungawulindi ungwabelanga sithi sizulu eh ayikhupaliswa ngelanga lendalo meaning ngeke uyikhupalisa namhlanje bese uyibhaye sakusasa inkonzo so we will work steadily u plan kahle eh have a routine please usiya ulwa encourage to consult for support engage your lecturers or peers and as we have said even us your counselors if you have the party that are uh, compromising your your learning uh, we urge you to be disciplined with your resources yes some of you who are nsp funded will be receiving laptops um, and most of you will be receiving data please use it for academic purposes fight the temptation to use it for other things we won't mention them you know what those things are that might tempt you right so lastly sebonga kakhulu thank you for watching and please look out for part 3 of this series sebonga